It's the smoke session. Ah. <laughs> that part, that part. Talk to you guys and um, just share your experience and how you got exposed to using it for medicinal purposes. So August 21st, wait, let's go back. Thank you all for coming. Thank you all for having me. I do have some home training. Um, August 21st, my life changed forever because I was diagnosed with stage one breast cancer. Went to the doctor and quickly found out that not everyone is comfortable with giving you a medical marijuana card, or even talking about it which is horrible because there's enough research out there to say what the medicinal benefits are. Um, however, many people choose pills over plants. And so the first thing they did was write me a prescription for oxycodone. And, uh, but what I didn't know, however, was the effects of CBD and how in some cases research shows that it actually shrinks the tumor size and it can actually help to prevent the reoccurrence of cancer. So by that point, I was all in. People do come to your practice and they ask you, you know, for the medical recommendation, what are some of the common um, conditions that they are asking for? So the common ailments that I typically see is definitely chronic pain. And it's secondary, it will be anxiety, depressive disorder. I'm a mom, I yeah. have two young children. I run a business. I don't have like two and three hours to mm -hmm. wait, and then when I get it, it's like mm -hmm. hey, this. <laughs> in your car, it's time consuming, but it's not really hard. Well, talk, can you talk about the steps of getting yeah. your car? For DC residents, so the conditions that that need uh, medical marijuana, or what researchers have found that medical marijuana will help. So it's usually like anxiety, depression, any type of mental health disorder, um, some neurological disorder like epilepsy, <coughs> definitely chronic pain, nausea, all those kind of things. Pretty much a lot of these um, conditions will qualify for medical marijuana. So in DC, all you have to do is find a provider who is willing to recommend you the medical marijuana certification. And then once you get the recommendation, you'll be presented with the ID and then you would go on the um, DCDOH website, put in the ID and you could either do it yourself in obtaining the card or like the dispensary Tacoma Wellness, they'll actually do it for you and then they'll also follow up with the process.